official Wandering Weekends Campground Review for Fort Mountain State Park near Chatsworth, Georgia. Welcome back, friends. So glad you're with us. If you are new, we're glad you're with us as well. Uh, we'll go ahead and explain how we do our campground reviews for you new folks. We break our categories. We have six different categories. We break them down from one to ten, one being the worst, ten being the best. The categories are accessibility, scenery, atmosphere, cost, comforts, and kid-friendly. You'll notice there's no such thing as a perfect campground. What scores well in one category may not score well in the other. So let's go ahead and get started with Fort Mountain State Park near Chatsworth, Georgia. All right, let's get started. Accessibility is our first category, and... Lots of twists and turns, uh, some steep grades getting up to Fort Mountain. Either if whether you come from the LJ side or the Chatsworth side, you're still going to deal with some tight turns, some steep grades. It's a little bit steeper and curvier coming up from the Chatsworth side. It's a little bit more, it's about 10 more extra miles coming up from the LJ side, and you still have some tight turns. So it's kind of a wash which way to come up. You're going to deal with a, a different situation each way. But um, lots of twists and turns. Once you get into the campground, you're going to dip back way down into what we call in the south a gully. And uh, I had to have four-wheel drive to back my RV into this site. Now, that's not going to be the case with most of the sites. We love this particular site. We were in site eight. But if I hadn't had four-wheel drive, there's no way I was getting it in there. So, I mean, I was, I was down a really deep, uh, really steep slope. And, um, I, yeah, I just had to have that four-wheel drive. So it doesn't score exceptionally well here. It scores a five. Okay, next category is scenery. And what we lost on the accessibility score, we certainly make up some with the scenery. This is a beautiful campsite. Lots of privacy. Uh, wooded, beautiful hardwoods all over. This was uh, the second weekend of October. So the leaves are starting to change at this elevation. Really beautiful. Great scenery across the little... Uh, ravine that we had to look over had a bear visitor a couple of days saw him that's probably the same bear i think saw him three times which was really really cool the kids really loved that scenery did really well scores an eight next up is atmosphere and fort mountain does very very well here very friendly staff the size of our campsite probably the biggest campsite we've had at a state park certainly the most private um no parties, no inappropriate behavior. This was during the week, so to be fair, there probably wasn't going to be much of that anyway. But the, the atmosphere was just wonderful. It scores a 10. Next category is cost. And 35 bucks a night gets you water and electricity. Uh, this one was a 30 amp. I think they did have 50 amp available. Uh, it was supposed to have cable. I'm not sure as ours worked. But um, for the cost, just like all of our other state parks, scores a 5. Fifth category is comforts, and this scores things like nearby dining, the campground amenities, uh, privacy. Privacy was off the charts at our particular site, and most of the sites had really great privacy at Fort Mountain. Uh, not, it, they did have some decent nearby dining down in Chatsworth, but that's a really curvy eight-mile drive, uh, so that doesn't necessarily help or hurt the score. It's a state park, so overall... You have uh, the availability of paddle boats, canoes, stuff like that, just across the street over on the lake, and lots of hiking trails. All of that was really great. Uh, overall, it scores a 7. Finally, our very favorite category, which is kid-friendly. And Fort Mountain is not terribly kid-friendly. Uh, the, the trail up to the actual fort and the lookout tower and the overlook, that is pretty kid-friendly. Most kids will be able to do that. Beckett knocked that out. No problem. He's three. He didn't have any issues. But there are a couple of the trails that are on the side of, a, of the mountain that are steep and rocky. I had to hold Beckett's hand the entire time. Uh, the, our particular campsite did drop off. So had I had a two-year-old, especially a one-year-old, uh, we would have been on edge the whole time. So that was a little bit, uh, that hurt the score for sure. We did have a bear almost every day we were there. So as cool as that is to see, it was a bear so you know i think you get what i'm saying there the playground was not in the campground it was in the day use area it was a good long walk to get to that so that did not help the score uh, overall it scores a six for kid friendly okay bonus round time and we do this to catch things that the campgrounds do exceptionally well uh, sometimes they get bonus points and sometimes they don't 
but uh, two bonus points for Fort Mountain. One, they have two dump stations, which that is very much appreciated. We didn't have to deal with it on Sunday, which is when the crowds generally leave, but I know it's appreciated when you need it. And then also, there's just an extra level of privacy that we haven't seen at state parks thus far. And I did want to give it an extra bonus point for that because there's no doubt they could pack in a lot more campsites than what they have. But that's one reason we really love state parks is the fact that they don't try to just make as many campsites as possible. And even at Fort Mountain, there's just so much privacy. I thought they deserved an extra point for that. So certainly an extra bonus point for the, the privacy. Okay, Fort Mountain State Park near Chatsworth, Georgia. Add it all up, and she scores a 43. Now, if you've watched our channel for any amount of time, you'll know that that is not an extraordinary score. And I think the reason being is it's, it's tough to get up there. So that really hurt the score some. And um, when I say it's tough, if you've got a half-ton truck and you're pulling a 32-foot plus travel trailer, you're going to be screaming, all right? Um, also, the kid-friendly score, our particular campsite certainly hurt that. Uh, that would probably be a little bit higher in some other sites. But the fact that the playground was off-site, that didn't help. So a 43, we would definitely go back. I love the privacy at this place. Uh, can definitely recommend Fort Mountain, even if it did score a 43. Thanks for watching, guys. If you have any buddies that are thinking about heading up to Fort Mountain, share this video with them. It really helps the channel. And uh, please consider subscribing.